Hello everyone. The task here is configuring dynamic NAT. Part 1. Configure dynamic NAT. Step 1. Configure traffic that will be permitted. On R2, configure one statement for access list 1 to permit any address belonging to 172.16.0.0 slash 16. Step 2. Configure a pool of address for NAT. If more than two devices attempt to access the Internet, there are only the two first devices being able to access the Internet. The others can't access, because there are only two available addresses in the address space. Step 3. Associate access list 1 with the NAT pool. Step 4. Configure the NAT interfaces. Part 2. Verify NAT Implementation Step 1. Access services across the Internet Now L1 PC1 or PC2 can access the web page for Server 1. Step 2. View NAT translations. That's all. Thank you for watching.